Welcome, it's a beautiful afternoon here in Finland uh, and Finland is now 100 years old so here in Espoo Public Library we will tell you 100 reasons why our libraries in Espoo are the best in the world so let's go and see it because it's so f cold in here So our library services are protected by the law and the law also says that uh, the use of our libraries is free and open for everyone. So it doesn't matter if you're a tourist just visiting Finland, you are welcome of course to come use our libraries. <sighs> the stated goals of the Library Act include promoting reading culture and versatile literary skills, lifelong learning, democracy, freedom of expression, active citizenship and equal opportunities to access education and culture. Also, library cards are completely free by law. All we need is your ID and an address in Finland. Because everybody can get a library card, there's no age limit for library cards, so even babies can get one. You just need to have a parent with you. Getting kids to be familiar with libraries is crucial, and we play a vital part in their lives. Beginning of every school year, our libraries give a free book to every first grader in Espo. We work with schools and have book tours, promoting reading and literacy. We have workshops where kids can make animations, practice coding and test different technologies. This is Börje. Uh, Börje is a certified reading dog. Reading to Börje makes reading easier, especially for children. We also have places for kids to play games and a huge spaces where teenagers and young adults can hang around. And these places have Things like table soccer, pool table, Xboxes, PlayStation computers, and more. Our libraries in Espoo are these huge uh, monumental buildings because we want our libraries to smoothly integrate to the everyday life of people. So that's why we have libraries in shopping centers, for example, the Iso Omena Library, with shared spaces with other public services, such as maternity and child health clinic, youth services, health center. National Social Security Office and Mental Health and Substance Abuse Services. So after visiting the nurse about your baby, uh, you can borrow some books about parenting and after that you can head to the Social Security Office to collect, collect your free baby box and after that you can head downstairs to do some shopping. We are now in the forest and next to the forest we have the library of Bear Swamp. Really nice that we also have libraries so close to nature and nature so close to libraries. This library is a self-service library, which means that you can come here with your own library card even when staff is no present. And there are many this kind of libraries in Espo, and it is all based in the system of trust and security cameras. We are now inside Balkke. A library bus, which is like really like brand new. We have actually two library buses in Espoo, uh, and they go around Espoo, for example, near the schools, and uh, you can see online all the places where it goes. This bus is also used for sexual education. It goes uh, from school to school, and there are sexual health professionals who talk with teenagers about sexual health and things that teenagers might wonder about. And also we give out these uh, library condoms for teenagers, because it's good to be responsible and take care of yourself. For the people who are unable to come to the libraries themselves, we delivered loans to you at home in bags like this. To make Finland feel like home, we also have services for immigrants. Those learning Finnish can come to our Finnish learning cafes and we provide services also in the languages of our local communities. For refugees, we offer support in handling bureaucracy and our staff has speakers in over 15 languages and we have material in over 100 languages. Everyone is free to make music in our libraries and for that we have electric drums, real drums, keyboards, pianos, grand pianos, electric guitars, acoustic guitars, air guitars, bass guitars, music rooms, recording workstations, professional notation programs and more. Many of our libraries have maker spaces 
like this one. And these are places where you can do, create and learn new things. Using these is completely free for everyone. Things in our makerspaces include 3D printers, expensive 3D printers, vinyl cutters, vinyl printers, poster printers, laminating machines, button machines, workstations for multimedia work, drawing screens, scanners for film, slides and large prints, workstations where you can digitize videotapes, retro and Super 8 film, compact cassettes, reel-to-reel -reel magnetic tapes and vinyl records. We have sewing machines, overlock sewing machines, cover stitch machines and embroidery machines. This makerspace has a woodworking area and this is for like a heavy duty creative action. And things we have here include our laser cutter, reel press, bandsaw, jigsaw, hot air gun, sanding machine, soldering station and lots and lots and lots of other tools. And just like you can borrow books, you can borrow all kinds of tools and items from our libraries. And things you can borrow include floppy disk drives, guitars, thermo detectors, basic tool sets, stud finders, gaiters, power consumption meter, sanding machine, cordless drills, hammer drills, rotary hammers, special drill bits, electric screwdrivers, tiny instruments, ukulele, kantele, bike pumps, spirit levels and trash pickers, and more. We also have spaces that you can freely use. For example, meeting rooms, stages where you can have events, and community space with a kitchen, jukebox, DJ set and more. Our staff has excellent work ethic. Our working environment is very relaxed. We are open-minded, we are free to experiment and question the rules and we take care of our occupational well-being and we have the best parties. So I really hope you enjoyed our video and I hope even more that you will come and visit our libraries. So see you in our libraries.